we continue our quest to open the secrets of the world. So, the final thing I guess we need to do now is... Oh, that's a little Viking ship! That's cute! Cute, 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 cute Viking ship, even though I guess it's now an Atlantean ship. For some reason, but let's go to Egypt. Oh, it's another dungeon thing. How original. It's a mouse. Computer mouse. Looks like it. I know it's just... Well, at least it has a little scribbles on the wall, but... Egypt, Egyptians didn't have that many. Just unknowns. Those are unknowns. They're not hieroglyphs. Those are unknowns. Presumably, I need to get that door to open. Oh, I like this music. Hello? Is that gonna smash my head if I walk past it? This is a museum, though. I bet not. But what if it does? Nah. See? Did not smash your head. Hold left shift to sprint. Why do I want to sprint? I do not want to sprint. Let's hide here for a while and just surveil our area. This has to be the creepiest one of them all. Hello. I pretty much now know that there probably is nothing here. No. Oh dear, I need to... Oh. I need to do something with that, but there's a note here. I pretty much know that there's probably no nothing here that can kill me. But it's still frightening. Professor Walker's diary. It's finally in my hands. Bela wrote last week to inform me that she had acquired the crystal fragment I was after. Of course, knowing how much I wanted it, she saw fit to double her fee. I, oh yeah, I did a male voice for Bela accidentally, so... Uh, sorry. She saw fit to double her fee. Certain that I'd pay any amount to get my hands on the artifact. This shard is unlike anything I have ever seen. It looks to have been cleanly cut from a much larger structure. But the material looks much too hard. Surely such precision incision would be impossible. It's beautiful. Truly magnificent. Its dull glow is not soothing. Hypnotic even. Now I can proudly put it in display in time for my pre-opening party next week. And of course that thing probably kills everyone and turns them into zombies and everything goes haywire blah. Well I'm not supposed to jump here, am I? I'm supposed to go over there, am I? Okay. Oh blah. Nice throw. God, I now I now know why this music is creepy to me. <sighs> oh, fuck me! Why did I remember this? If you're not Finnish or well Scandinavian, I don't think you will understand why I'm getting creeped out by this. But there is this children's TV show called The Moomin. And there's this really scary, at least to me, and other Scandinavian probably, 
really fucking scary monster from my childhood. So that music when it goes to it reminds me of her. And yes, now this actually is getting into my skin. Oh, I understand now why I need to run. But I went a little bit too late on that, and I'm gonna wait until it goes. Clunk. Alright, let's do that again. I didn't have to fucking memorize those things up there. The hieroglyphs and the alphabets, I just hope that's a little touch to make this more feel more museum like. Because there's no way I, in hell I can remember those things. Alright, here we have the little dog god. This is a button to do something with. Before I do that, let's go and have a chat with Anubis or whatever he is. And the tombs of many pharaohs were protected against grey robbers. The resting place of King Tails was hidden behind a secret door in his own tomb, which is said to have been guarded by curses and other supernatural forces. The name of the pharaoh himself was used to seal the tomb. Well, that's not, that doesn't sound really interesting, but whatever. That's a nice little info, but there's nothing else here, is there? Nope, we can go and press the button. Hmm, more stuff here. I need to spell Teos, don't I? Crap. Is there any way to get back there? Jesus fucking Christ, that's a little silly. Of course I could just randomly try and get it right. to figure out that I won't go and start I'm gonna go and check if I can go and get to it. Oh you can go in and out now. That's nice. Uh, I should not really be thinking about that fucking bitch. Oh, and if you want to Google her, her name is the Groak. So, go ahead and Google her. The Finnish voice, the Finnish voice over for her is by far the scariest one of all of them, in my opinion. All right, the sun is T. Toothbrushes are E. The sound testing thing is O, and S is straw. Sun, toothbrush, sound, straw. Sun, toothbrush, sound, straw. Sun, toothbrush, sound, sun, toothbrush, sound, and straw. Sun, toothbrush, 
sound and straw. Sun, toothbrush, sound. And straw. There we go. Not that hard. We have the final key. And we can just get out of the head, get out of here, away from this music, get away from this music, get away from this place. It's triggering. This music is triggering me, guys. Uh, so awful. So, we have the final. Oh, not that way. Final door. The final, <laughs> final fucking key. The final key into the chamber. The vault. Of secrets. Open. Sesame.